Okay, good morning. My name is Bill Swan. I'm developing a solar tracking uh, microcontroller application down here. Um, as you may know, if you track the sun, uh, the, the gains from a solar panel array uh, for Houston are 30% more than what they would be if they were static panels. So I've worked with Bipalm Electronics using their microcontroller boards and developed the software to uh, cause panels to move. And if you can read the lines on this, uh, this LCD display, the first line shows the, the date and the time. The second line shows the elevation and the azimuth of the sun for the date and time. And the, uh, the microcontroller has been programmed to, to uh, look up the time, date, and estimate the azimuth and elevation, and I say estimate, uh, I, every degree I, I move the, the panels. And uh, the, the last two lines on the display are it's waiting for the next integer value of the elevation or the azimuth, and when it reaches that next integer value, uh, it, it will move the panels one degree. And these, uh, this is a relay board right here. Uh, there are three boards involved. The middle board is the real-time clock. It, uh, you store and it remembers the date and time, and the bottom board has a, a microcontroller on it that, that has been programmed. And unfortunately, it's going to take another 0.6 degree movement in the, uh, in the azimuth before uh, the relays will click. And I've just got these LED, well, there, there it is, elevation down. I was looking at the wrong one. Uh, the, the elevation value is getting smaller now because it's in the afternoon and it just uh, changed from 46 to 45.95. And, and the, the LEDs are here just to simulate a, a connection to a synchronous step motor. Um, step motors run at 72 RPM, so um, at, the, at a constant RPM, I know exactly how far they've moved when I turn them on for an interval of time. And uh, um, basically, that's it. It's a, it's a, it's a standalone package, uh, reasonably inexpensive. Um, I might also point out I'm in the run mode right now. If I push this button, I'm in the stopped mode. If uh, a rainstorm is coming or if you want to move the panels for cleaning, you, you go to the stop mode and then press the jog button and, and you'll note the LEDs are turning on. It, either you want to jog the, the array left or right or up or down and you can position it for cleaning. Um, this microcontroller, uh, had initially designed it for a 700 watt array but my next step is uh, to have it control a 2500 watt array. And with the, the way prices of uh, panels are dropping these days, um, uh, more is better and, and, and affordable. <laughs> Thank you very much.